Hi, welcome to all. Welcome to Kalagati. Today, we are going to discuss about the topic, what does your Mars sign is telling in your natal chart? So, Mars, you all know what is the Mars. Mars is energy, aggressiveness, and uh, the fighting spirit. So, Mars, wherever he is sitting, okay, those things you will not at all compromise. At any cost, you need a success. At any cost, you need a success. There you will show the aggression, the fighting spirit, okay, and uh, you show that uh, kind of a confidence to win over those things. So, at any cost, you will not at all compromise. So, Mars is that kind of a symbol in your chart. It is the battery okay? where, the, where it will produce the energy in your chart. Okay? Let us see the Mars in different signs, what they will do. <coughs> Suppose Mars is in Aries. So, here in Aries, the process of energy, okay, the chemical reaction inside will blow up like a volcano in everyday activities, okay. So, this energy, this energy, you want, this energy, you want, so here is, this energy you want to utilize by playing games, activities, okay? You want to lead a, a kind of a lifestyle which that a chemical energy inside you, the volcanic effect, okay? Need to be utilized at any cost, okay? If you are not playing anything, you are not playing any sports and uh, your lifestyle is uh, only sitting and doing some job, okay? And the Mars is in your air is sign, this will mess up. This energy at any cost, this chemical reaction, this volcanic effect need to come out. Okay. Need to be a come out from an outlet. Okay. But you are sitting and doing some computer job. Suppose you are a software engineer and you are doing some uh, computer work. Okay. There is no logical outlet to come out. The energy need to come out, but there is a no logical outlet. Then this Mars will come in the form of anger, aggression, violence. Okay. Then other people who are living with you will suffer. You want to show a logical outlet. Okay. To come out this a chemical reaction, this volcanic effect, if Mars is sitting in your airy side. If you don't show that logical outlet, this energy comes in the form of anger, aggression, okay, hurting others. Because Mars is supporting you to do your daily activities in more kind of a, this precise energy is supporting you to do much more works in your daily routines. You want to play sports, you want to do some, some kind of a athletic activity, else your life will suffer. Okay. Suppose your Mars is sitting in a Taurus. Taurus is all about a materialistic things. Okay. It is an earthy sign. And uh, the Mars want to showcase, will give that energy to achieve the materialistic goals. For example, if you want a new car, you want a building, you want to plan a holiday trip, okay? You want to set a goal and a deadline, okay? You want to set a goal and deadline. I want this in this time. I want to earn this in this time with a goal mind of kind of a setup, okay? If you showcase to that, uh, this deadline, the goal to the Mars, then the Mars energy will tune along that and work on that line, okay? Then 
you will achieve those things uh, with the mars energy okay so set a, if your mars is in taurus set a deadline set a goal okay i want to buy a new car i want to buy a building i want to buy an apartment i want to buy a property i want to buy a gems i want to buy a valuable things you need to set a goal and keep a deadline then mars energy will support you okay if you don't pay attention to this okay it will give apathy depression okay then the mars uh, will will always trigger you there is no change in the life just change your life change your life okay. so you have a disbelief okay mars will create a disbelief on yourself so this will bring that apathy and depression upon you okay so set a goal and deadline if mars is in taurus if mars is in gemini gemini is all about information communication intelligence when mars is sitting here okay you want to plan everything okay year wise monthly wise day wise even hour wise okay so you want to keep it a very planned way you want to write in diaries you want to plan your curriculum your time table okay so um, keep tuned with a, a scheduling kind of a work routine scheduling okay i want to do this in this time i want to do this in this time okay so the everything need to be very planned and everything you will search for the information so the searching apps google search all these things need to be available if mars is sitting in germany because mars energy is searching for information searching for the information it is very fast and it, it don't uh, stay at all okay it is it is running the mars energy will run go through you okay so it need a information so the scheduling apps and uh, the google search kind of apps okay need to be there or always with you okay it need information if uh, okay if this this mars energy okay not able to get all these things okay in germany the mars need to do multitasking because germany will give multitasking ability so mars there is no scheduling and there is no proper planning there is no kind of a information providers like a google search then the brain will stuck up because mars energy is running and uh, you are not giving that uh, kind of a information to the mars okay so this will hit your mind okay you will be in a confusion you will always in a confusion way okay you always deal the life in a confusion way if you don't use properly use mars in germany then it will lead a confusion confused life okay so if your mars is in germany okay install scheduling apps okay gather the information provide the information for the mars okay then the mars will satisfy or else it is it will be more in a hunger way it will destroy your mind if mars is in a cancer if mars is in a cancer here the mars need emotions love love and emotions okay so mars is a kind of a aggressive energy cancer is a sensitive energy so here emotional emotional mind okay so the energy the this aggr aggressive energy always search for a comfortability in any situation it need an emotional comfortability it always strive to keep a comfortable zone okay 
if someone is going to hurt you emotionally then the mars will recognize that okay so many people will hurt emotionally daily in every life in every life every person will face a emotional issues okay while you are driving in the uh, driving a car okay? suddenly a guy come across then you will emotionally you will, you will get disturbed if mars is there in the cancer you come out of that car and hit that guy okay this kind of a emotional comfort zone if anybody disturbs the mars will come out this daily will happen that's why you need to calm your mind be calm treat everything in life with a accountability acceptability okay this is the strength do meditation okay don't uh, outburst when you are emotionally disturbed count numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay so if you are not able to channelize mars in cancer it uh, the mars will hit you by giving a mental disorders okay so isnomia eating disorders okay these things will happen if you are not properly channelize mars energy in cancer okay so you should not come over for every emotional disturbance you need to calm down count the numbers okay don't react the situations don't show your strength don't outburst if you are emotionally not comfortable okay come out of that situation come out of that place okay don't involve in a destructive way this will give you mental disorders next comes leo if mars is in leo okay leo is all about a top position authority respect so mars is in a mars is showing a aggressive kind of energy this aggressive energy is fighting for the top position authority top position and authority mars is fighting for top position and authority okay so here self esteem self respect self respect if you develop your creative abilities kindness and broad soul generosity towards others okay and respect towards others this energy will properly channelize so when ma your mars is in a leo okay strive hard for self esteem okay try for respect show your aggression in getting respect from others mars will show the aggression to get a top position authority okay so try for a government jobs try for a, a, a kind of authority jobs okay try for a leadership job, jobs okay you you are you need to be a, like a public person public servant okay plan everything in a straight way okay try to attract attention from others okay so if you are not uh, channelizing this if you are not a public person you are not planning and you are not uh, able to attract the attention okay you are sitting in a corner then your mars energy is not getting a, a kind of a proper logical outlet okay to utilize the energy okay so then this energy will upset you upset your confidence levels okay if you are not social person this energy will upset you okay you always be in a less confident way you will deal everything in a less confident way okay so don't sit in a corner don't sit a ideal don't sit a, uh, alone okay try to be mix up with the public grab the attention okay so try to be a leader then the mars energy 
for mars energy you are showing a proper logical outlet to come over and give the kind of a benefit as a leadership if you don't show that it will bring the depression and low confidence level it will bring the low confidence level you are not able to do everything uh, the energy will try to come in the form of ego domination authoritative domination so this will distract your chat your personality next come virgo if mars is in virgo virgo is all about a perfection mars is all about actions wonderful combination actions need to accumulate with a perfection will come, need to come out with a perfection okay so virgo is all about a health okay natural sixth house immunity power and the mars is ruling the virgo this is a quite a good combination here you want to take care of your health okay you want to take care about the nature about the environment and you want to pay attention with your family related to health okay and uh, you want to pay everything with a perfection you want to plan your actions with a perfection plan everything okay plan your budgets plan your money count your money in a precise way daily count your money just account it everything plan every action every daily routines in a perfect way so when you are planning everything in a perfect way the energy began the mars energy began to circulate and bring you that perfection creativity if uh, you are not able to take you are not uh, able to take care your health not only your health uh, your relatives your family okay you are not able to take care of the health uh, and uh, you are not able to uh, uh plan your actions you are plan your actions in a, to get in a perfect way then this energy okay then this energy will be right you not not only give a serious health conditions ill effects ill health effects okay it always you will always suffer with the ill health because of low immunity no proper logical outlet for the mars to come out from the virgo okay so plan everything in a perfect way if uh, mars sitting in a libra libra is all about balancing what you want to balance so your aggression mars aggression need to be balanced okay try to communicate with others in a positive way try to communicate with your relationships with your spouse with your husband with your wife talk in a generous way don't go in a aggressive mode okay don't cheat don't cheat in relationships don't uh, communicate uh, back behind your back okay so no hypocrisy okay don't talk uh, in a negative way maintain the relationship uh, with a cool and calm mind balance your aggressiveness okay try to communicate try to communicate with your relationships okay don't uh, think with the natural instincts mars will think with the natural instincts emotions okay so try to communicate don't take decisions in relationship without communicating if you take decisions without communicating this will lead a serious problem with others in relationships you will destroy the relationships <laughs> so develop uh, loyalty with your partners okay so develop uh, a faith 
in your relationships, then you are showing a logical outlet to the mass. Okay. So if you don't uh, show that logical outlet, uh, then you will fight in the relationships. You will not able to balance your anger. You will showcase unbalanced, uneven aggression on others in relationships. Okay. Please take care about your relationships and uh, try to communicate. Uh, don't uh, judge with the natural instincts. Libra, Mars in Libra, the people will judge uh, everyone with their natural instincts without communicating. But you want to show the logical outlet uh, for the Mars with the communication. When Mars is in Scorpio, Scorpio is all about uh, up and downs, transformations, pain, risk. Okay. So, this is all about a Kama, Krodha, Loba, Moha, Madha, Matsarya, Arishad, Vargas, Scorpio. The Mars is aggression. So Mars shows uh, the passion, aggression. If they love anyone, they will go very deep. Okay. They don't bother they are loving you or not. But they will go in a very deep manner. Okay. When uh, this person came to know that uh, that uh, opposite person is not living, then uh, the event very deep and the heartbreak. Okay. So it is very painful. It is a very painful kind of a situation. So Scorpio is all about a transformation of your energy, Mars energy, transformation of your aggressive nature. Mm -hmm. Okay. Huh? So, what Raga can you go to the future? And So, Raga, can you go to the future? So, Raga, can you go to the future? Okay. So, they were aggression, the deep passionate love. Okay. So don't go with the natural instinct, or don't go very deep. Okay. Don't love someone very deep. Don't show aggression very deep. Okay. And uh, don't uh, think very deep. If you go that much deep, the pain will be there. So do everything correctly. Okay. If you love someone, communicate with them and express your love. Okay. Don't uh, be it like a one-sided love. Okay. If you want to bring a leadership, uh, come forward. Okay. Don't do anything uh, behind. Scorpio is working behind, uh, secretive. So don't do anything so behind. So come forward and uh, take re that responsibility as a leader. Okay. So, this is the Mars energy. If you do this, the Mars energy will have a right outlet to come forward. And the nice utilization of Mars energy will happen when you take this transformation. Okay, Don't uh, love anyone deeply and uh, don't do anything secretively. Okay. So, if you love someone, just go directly and tell to them, don't do one side love. Okay. So accept the changes. Okay. If you love, it is uh, it is not always right that other person also want to love. Okay. It is their choice. Accept the transformation. Okay. If you have acceptance of this uh, transformation, then this energy will circulate properly and uh, develops your uh, personality. Okay. If uh, you are not uh, showing this transformation of aggression, then it leads to serious disorders. Okay. We, we are seeing many people uh, uh, pouring acid on other people okay. because uh, their uh, uh, other person did not accept their love. So these people 
they attacked those people with the acid bottles so don't show don't show your aggression in that way this is the wrong way okay try to accept the transformation okay. so next comes uh, mars in a sagittarius sagittarius is all about uh, higher knowledge higher knowledge is available with uh, persons who are uh, greater in in age and experience so we call them as gurus elder people so and also higher knowledge will available from books higher knowledge is available from uh, religion god so sagittarius is all about uh, gurus books religion god and the mars is sitting here so mars will show the aggressiveness in reading the books in reading the religion in reading the god and talking to gurus to get that higher knowledge so be active be very active okay don't fight with gurus okay accept what they are telling if they don't match with your ideas accept that uh, the teachings accept the religion teachings accept gurus okay if you don't like just ignore and uh, uh, go to other gurus for the higher knowledge read books okay if you don't do these things if your mars is in sagittarius if you are not doing these things then that mars energy will find for an outlet okay it will show the rashness dealing with elderly people you will show that rashness aggressiveness with your father with your mother all the elderly people if you are not able to accept these changes you will fight with everyone okay you want to show your greatness about your higher knowledge the energy will go in a negative way so try to accept the changes try to accept the gurus try to accept the books religion god give respect to the elders okay don't show the pride don't uh, fight with gurus don't fight with the elderly people so this is a complete negative thing so mars in sagittarius always always want to accept the views of others okay he he need to have a belief on their views but he need to accept other people views okay he should not fight with other people views okay no debates no discussions okay the debates and discussions need to go in a positive way with accepting and exchanging your views with other views okay this is the positive way of uh, expressing the mars energy in sagittarius if mars is in the uh, capricorn capricorn is all about a uh, political professional ambitious need to raise uh, financially okay these things uh, will happen in a uh, capricorn and the mars is sitting in capricorn which is exalted position for mars okay so dream everything in a large way okay always go forward to achieve that even obstacles will come in your way but uh, mars will help you to achieve that position okay that name and fame okay you you want to set uh, that goals you want to climb a mountain just uh, do it mars will help you okay you will grow financially politically okay the mars aggression uh, will is in exalted state so it always show a positive sign the so aggression passion dedication heroism will come out in a positive way there is a no negative way in the capricorn okay try to dream on your career try to dream on uh, uh, your financial status okay your uh, name and fame if you are not thinking about these things uh, the mars energy will become useless okay 
So you are not able to deal the risky things. If you are not able to deal the risky things, you will go into depression. So if you are not able to use this uh, Mars in Capricorn, you will go in a serious depression. Financially, dealing with other people with a low confidence. These are the signs uh, if you are not properly utilizing your Mars in the Capricorn. Mars in Aquarius. Aquarius is, is all about a humanitarian effect. Humanitarians. Okay? They will strive very hard uh, to uplift the society. Aquarius is all about uh, social networks. Facebook, Twitter, WhatsApp, YouTube. All will come in uh, Aquarius. Okay? It's all about information technology, computers. Okay? So try to communicate and build large networks. Try to communicate and build large networks. Don't show your aggression uh, with your friends, with your social contacts. Okay, don't try to dominate. Be polite and act like a humanitarian. Influence the other people with your confidence. Okay, not with aggression, not with your domination. If you are acting like a humanitarian and uh, keeping your Mars energy to uplift the society, that is the positive way. If you are not involving in any communication, not involving in any, uh, we are not able to communicate with your friends and social contacts, so when Mars is sitting in Aquarius, uh, then this Mars will hurt you. Okay. So, this energy, if you are not able to use, okay, you are not able to success socially. It will give depression socially. Okay. So you will cross the boundaries. Okay. You will cross the boundaries and uh, your friends will become enemies if you are not able to utilize this Mars energy in Aquarius. Mars in Pisces. Mars in Pisces. Pisces is all about loneliness, alone. Okay. Devotion towards the God, meditation, yoga. Okay. Keeping an eye within yourself. yourself. Okay. Seeing yourself inside. That is Pisces. Mars here. Mars. Okay. So you want to utilize the Mars energy to show dedication. Suppose you want you set a deadline that uh, I will do meditation for 30 minutes. Then Mars will cooperate with you. Then if you are uh, set a goal to read Bhagavad Gita, then Mars will uh, cooperate with you. So if you want to do yoga, then Mars will cooperate with you. So the Mars energy need to have a, that a spiritual touch. Okay. Become like a karate guru. Become like a yoga guru. So, you know how to fight, but you will not fight. You will try in. Try in others. This is the positive way you want to show if Mars is in Pisces. If you are not able to utilize the energy properly, okay, you will become a confused. You will not able to relax. You are not able to sleep. Sleep disturbances will come. Okay. Because you are not showing Mars a proper logical outlet to come out. You will become a sluggish, weak, uninteresting. So, you always want to become a you want to show this outlet, Mars outlet, uh, in doing a uh, meditation, in reading spiritual lectures, literatures. And you can also become a karate guru, yoga guru, a fighting master. You know how to fight, but you are only interested in training, not to fight with others. So this kind of uh, positive makeup will show the Mars a proper channel. If you don't do it, okay, the Mars will force you anyway. The Mars will uh, force you anyway, whether it is a 
if you are utilizing positively or negatively that is entirely your choice okay so the negative thing is you will show the aggression the fighting spirit okay for your sake for the selfish sake if you are channelizing the mars energy in positive way you will fight a uh, for entire society take examples of a uh, narasimha swami lord narasimha the anger the destruction the aggressiveness he shown to protect uh, the all the living beings living on the earth so he killed a kiran hiranyakashipu so your anger aggression need to serve other people suppose take a doctor a doctor want to do an operation he want to see the blood he want to stitch the everything okay that much cruelty he will show but for what sake to cure you to cure your ill health so mars cruelty brutality he is a saving your life so this is the proper channel of a showing mars aggression okay don't show the way negatively don't hurt others emotionally okay don't hurt others physically if you are dealing the mars energy in this way it will uh, completely destroys you don't use this energy for your selfish sake okay so if you have a power force try to protect others don't destroy with that power okay don't kill others if you have a ability okay so don't showcase try to protect others suppose uh, you know how to use the bow and archer okay so don't kill animals don't hunt animals try to protect them so your anger aggression energy need to come to protect the environment to protect the human being okay it should not uh, come for uh, destroying those things okay. so think about your friends think about your mars signs okay try to channelize that mars energy in a proper way okay. this is all about uh, uh, mars in uh, different signs hope uh, you all like this okay. if you have any doubts okay. let me know